to repressurize your Ideal Logic Combi um, is quite simple. There's two knobs underneath here, two levers that you have to adjust. So we're going to show you how to do that. So what will happen if your boiler, your Logic is at low pressure, you'll have an F1 fault, which we've got here. And on the gauge, that'll be showing down to around zero bar. So when that occurs, it's time to top the pressure up. So we're gonna show you how to do that. There's something you have to be careful of when repressurizing these, and that's to not leave the valve in the wrong position because you'll be left with no hot water. I'm gonna show you how to leave the valves in the correct position so you're not left with no hot water. I've got two blue knobs here and here. And at the moment you can see they're both facing upwards and that's how they have to be left when you've finished repressurizing. So this is the key one to make sure is pointing down. If that's left in this position, then you're gonna have no hot water coming out your taps. So to repressurize the boiler, simply open up that valve and do the same with this valve, but do this slowly. You'll hear a hissing noise. When it gets to the correct pressure, which is just above one bar in the green zone, close it off again. And as I said, make sure you close that one down completely. And that's in the position it should remain until you have to repressurize it again. Keep your eye on the pressure gauge to make sure it's at one bar or just above one bar. Don't let it go too high, because if you do, that's gonna cause other issues. So that's where the pressure needs to be when you've repressurized it. You also need to keep an eye on when you've got the heating on that that pressure doesn't start to rise. If it does rise and gets to that three mark with a red line, then you've got a problem and you need to call an engineer out to have a look, see if you've got a problem with your expansion vessel or an issue elsewhere. But um, that is simply how to repressurize your boiler and get your boiler back and out of the F1 state.